This brief tutorial introduces you to using the Dragon Medical One desktop application. When Dragon Medical One opens, you'll log in with your username or assigned login credentials. If you have any questions about your login, you should ask your administrator. Select the microphone you'll be using. The available microphones for your computer will be listed here. Ensure that your microphone is plugged in prior to signing on. The default language is English, and the default specialty is General Medicine. Select the most relevant specialty from the list. Dragon enables you to use your voice like a voice-activated keyboard. With Dragon, you can dictate your findings directly into a patient report. Depending on your configuration, you'll either have a power mic, a headset, or some other external microphone. Click the Talk button on your external microphone to begin dictating. It's important to note that Dragon can't hear you when the microphone icon is red or when the microphone is not turned on. Position your cursor where you want your dictated text to appear. The dictation box opens when Dragon doesn't recognize where the dictation should go. If this happens, just position your cursor in the correct place and click or say Transfer Text. Dictate with punctuation to save editing time. Your documentation is added to the patient record as you speak. Subjective colon new line. Jennifer is a 42-year-old female presenting with symptoms of facial discomfort, comma, eye pain, comma, and postnasal drip for approximately three months, period, new paragraph. Patient states she has sinus problems, but this infection has been quite severe. She has seen no improvement with antibiotics, period. Use your voice to navigate, select, and update specific information. When you say commands, remember to pause briefly between speaking your command and beginning your dictation. Like this. Insert before eye pain. Nasal congestion, comma. The command insert after works much like insert before. Insert after severe. Period. Notice how Dragon capitalizes the next sentence for you. Insert after antibiotics, period. She also noted that she is having some problems with balance and possible hearing loss, ear popping, comma, and fullness, period. When you are ready to move to the next section, you can navigate to the end of a paragraph and create a new one using voice commands. Like this. Go to end of paragraph. New paragraph. Assessment colon. If you just want to move down one line, use the command new line. New line. Fiber optic nasopharyngoscopy identifying turbinate hypertrophy and nasal septum deviation to the left, comma, more significant posteriorly, period. Say, what can I say to call up a list of commands to control navigation, settings, formatting, and more. Sometimes, corrections are necessary. We find there are three primary reasons for this. Sometimes Dragon will not understand you correctly. Other times, you might have said the wrong thing and need to fix it. Or lastly, you may realize after you are finished that you need to add or take away text from your note. The more you use Dragon and correct dictation errors, the better Dragon learns how you dictate. Let's look at some dictated text and go over how to fix the errors we find. The SELECT command is very useful, as it allows you to highlight words or phrases and then modify them as you wish. Let's select a piece of text and then dictate new text to replace it. SELECT 42-YEAR-OLD See that Dragon has a correction menu. If the correction you need to make is one of the numbered options, you can select it from the list. 46-year-old. Dragon overwrites the old text with the new dictation. You can also use the SELECT command to highlight sections of dictation and delete or modify as needed. SELECT WITH THROUGH COMPLEX. DELETE THAT. There are built-in formatting commands to modify the dictated text. SELECT SUBJECTIVE. ALL CAPS THAT. SELECT OBJECTIVE. All caps that.
You can also immediately delete dictated text using the scratch that command. Insert before patient. History provided by patient and her husband. Scratch that. There is also the undo that command. Undo that works like the undo button. You can use it to undo actions. Select she through antibiotics. Delete that. Undo that. As you can see, scratch that deletes the last text that was just dictated, where undo that undoes the last action. Remember to use scratch that for dictated text and use undo that for actions. Every hospital or doctor's office will have certain words, phrases, or specific names that Dragon will not know. Your administrator can upload a word list specific to your site or group, and you can also add your own words to create your own personal vocabulary. Let me show you an example. Insert after antibiotics period. Patient reports being prescribed antibiotics by Dr. Shi at MGH period. You can see that Dragon misrecognized the name of the doctor. To fix this, we'll need to add it as a custom word to our vocabulary. Say the voice command, Manage Vocabulary. This brings up the vocabulary menu. Click this button to search the custom word list or filter by site, group, or user. Clicking the plus sign will bring up the interface to add a word. Here, we'll add Dr. Shi's name as a custom word in the written form field. Next, we'll click the microphone icon to train Dragon how we pronounce our word. If your custom word is pronounced exactly as it's spelled, you can just use the default pronunciation. Let's train our word. Dr. Shi. For some words, Dragon will also ask you to write out the pronunciation. We'll type in the pronunciation here. Now, back to our dictation. Before we use our new word, we have to delete what we dictated earlier. Select patient through MGH period. Delete that. Patient reports being prescribed antibiotics by Dr. Shi at MGH period. This time, Dragon recognizes the doctor's name and spells it correctly 